Hi there, I'm Matt from the Underground Cookery School. Lovely spring dish for you. We've got rump end of lamb with spinach and spring onions. You're going to love it. Hi there, I've got such a lovely dish for spring, uh, very light uh, even though it's lamb. I'm going to show you how to bone out the, the backside of a lamb, the chump end, and then we're going to cook it off and serve it with some spinach which is in season and obviously spring onions. So the first job is just to get the fillet off here, I'm only going to do one side, uh, otherwise it will take forever, but you can get the, this cut, you can order it from the butcher, and if you do so, you know there's quite a lot that isn't fillet, which you'll see in a minute, which you can then use in sort of stews and curries, and you can also make a stock out of the bone. It's the same sort of basic principle as chicken. If you know how to bone out a chicken, then you've got two meals and the bones to make a stock. And I'm just going to use the tip of the knife just to peel away the fillet. Always working as close to the bone as I possibly can, and then that just kind of peels off. So that's going to come off, there we go. As you can see there's quite a lot of meat still in there and that I'm going to trim down later, make a burger with it, you know, plenty to do. And then you've got the nice fillet there, I mean that will actually feed me only, but a lot of people you can get two out of that. A little bit of olive oil, um, just a little bit of black pepper and salt and that's going to go in the oven on about uh, 160 degrees for about 35 minutes and then once it comes out of the oven what you need to do is let it rest so it carries on cooking um, and then we can um, finish it off in the uh, present the dish maybe 10 minutes later so in the oven it goes I'm going to let that rest for probably five or six minutes. I say this every time, but it's very hot. It's about, if it's cooked all the way through, it's going to be around about 75 degrees, maybe even 80. It's going to carry on being hot. So by letting it cook out of the oven, it just tenderizes it. Never serve meat when it comes straight out of the oven because it's far too tough. I'm going to show you how to cook spinach because it's bang in season and it's absolutely delicious if it's cooked this way. A little olive oil in the pan and I'm going to put some butter in as well just to give it an extra bit of depth of flavour. I've got two things which I'm going to add first. Some chopped garlic and some chilli. And just give that a little bit of a toss. Whilst that's cooking off, we're going to fry off the spinach, but um, I just want to tell you a little bit about it. When you peel the spinach off the bark, give it a good wash because it's always quite sandy. So you just take those off. You end up with a load of leaves. And actually, what I'm going to do, a lot of spinach doesn't go very far. It shrinks quite, quite dramatically during the cooking process. And it needs a little bit of love and nurturing. And I've got some spring onions, so I'm going to add those as well you know, because it's, it's a spring dish. So I'm going to keep that turning. And once those leaves have completely wilted down, what I'm going to do is just press out the juices in here, by which time the meat will be ready to carve, and then we'll plate the dish up. See, I just think this, this smells of spring. It's just great. You get so fed up at the end of a season and you can't wait for new stuff to come in and now here it is and it's just great. So actually it's cooked down quite well so there's very little juice in there. So I'm just going to leave that there for the moment. Just carve up the uh, lamb. Uh, I mean that's got quite a nice bounce to it. When you do carve meat, if you can, always try and cook on the angle. It just looks a bit more professional when you present. This is just quite a light dish. So there's no heavy sauce to it. I'm just going to dress it with a little bit of pan juice, which I think can go quite nicely. But you've got this lovely spring onion and spinach salad. So that, that forms the base. 
And then you can just sort of put that on there. I think I'm only going to do that as a portion. And then finally, I'm just going to ju just lightly dress with those pan juices. And I think that's absolutely delicious. So there you have a rump of lamb with a salad of spinach and spring onions with chilli and garlic. Enjoy. Thank you for watching. It's competition time now. Someone's going to win a pasta machine for free. I'm going to send it to them. People left a review on either Facebook or Google, having come down here, giving us their email address, and their name goes into the hat. And this week it is... It's Tanya Refson. So congratulations, Tanya. A pasta machine is working its way over to you. Next time, do watch, because I'm going to show you how to make a, a beautiful dress crab. And, and then we're going to dress it. So I'm going to show you how to do a mayonnaise. And we're going to do it with spring onion and chilli. Nice, nice spring dish. So look out for that. And thank you for watching. I hope you tune in soon.